Welcome to Dynamics Ignite from Technology Management. In this video, we are going to look at how you can use budgets in Microsoft Dynamics NAV to compare your actual performance against your budgeted performance. We will set up a budget for 2014 and then compare our actual performance against the budgeted performance. Finally, we will see how the integration with Microsoft Excel helps you maintain your budgeted values. In Microsoft Dynamics NAV 2013, you can have as many budgets as you want for the period that you want. This allows you to monitor the actual performance of your company against a set of budgeted criteria. In the following example, we are going to focus on a sales budget for 2014. I am going to edit the budget. As you can see, I've already entered the figures for January and February. I can enter the figures directly into my budget for March. Once you've entered the values, they can be edited at any point. For example, I can change February to 13,000. Although I only see 13,000 here, if I go into it, I can actually see that this is made up of two figures, the original 12,000 and then the additional 1,000. In this example, I have set the budget per month, but you can also set it for a day, week, period, quarter or year. You can also use dimensions within your budgets. For example, here we've got the department filter, project filter and area filter. In this example, I could set my budget for sales per area. And then when I'm comparing, I can compare my actual for that area to my budget for that area. I can now compare my balance to budget. I'm looking at the sales accounts. And I can see that for my retail domestic that my net change is greater than my budget so that I have a positive balance to budget. Now that we have reviewed the actuals to budget we can now see how easy it is to import and export to Excel. First of all I'm going to export the current budget to Excel. I can change any of the filters if required. This will then open up into Excel and I can change any of the figures if required or add new ones. I'm going to change this. I can then save the file to my desktop. I can then go back into my budget and import that. I can either replace the entries or I can also add the entries. In this case, I'm going to replace them and this is the description that it will put on there with the date. If you want to do your budget by department, for example, you can filter your export here. Then when you import the files, you can just append them so that you get a total budget for all departments. Once your budget is complete, you can copy it to the next period if you want to and also include an adjustment factor if required. In summary, Microsoft Dynamics NAV 2013 makes it easy for you to create multiple budgets for a period. You can then filter these budgets by dimension values, for example, departments. You can then review your progress against the budget for individual departments or the total for all departments. It is easy for you to export the budget into Excel to share with the department managers. Then the updated budgets can be imported back into NAV. Budgets are an easy to use feature that allow you to monitor your company's progress towards its financial goals.